welcome to the show. Uh, I'm your host, uh, Frank Hope, and uh, Melissa, that was uh, great as always. Oh, thanks, Frank. Uh, sure. Hi. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, now, uh, wait, did you say thank? No, you didn't say, uh, no. I, oh, uh, uh, I, I said thanks. Okay, and then I said you're welcome. Yes, okay, that's there we how go. it went, yeah. Uh, uh, now, I wonder, do you like uh, shopping at all, Melissa? Oh, yeah, I love to shop. You do like shopping? For everything and anything. I, I love I to shop. Uh, you like shopping? I, I don't care for it too much. You don't like uh, shopping? No, I just like to uh, know, you know, when I, when I need to get something, I like to know exactly what I'm going to go buy, and then I, I go see. shopping. I don't like to browse and stuff. So you, you probably know. don't like big department stores where there's... You can't find exactly what you're looking for right away. No, that confuses me a yeah, lot. Yeah, okay. uh, I can see that. Okay, and uh, David, uh, maybe we can uh, talk about your uh, shopping habits a little uh, later, right? Okay. Um, all right. Well, let's, um, without uh, further ado, bring out our first uh, guests. Uh, actually, three guests. Uh, it's uh, Ms. Stacy Ferguson, Ms. Stephanie Vidal, and Ms. Renee Sandstrom, and they are Wild Orchid. <laughs> Now, maybe if you could each just introduce yourselves. Uh, uh, well, I'm Stacy. Stacy. I'm Renee. And I'm Stephanie. Stephanie, okay. And of course, uh, oh, thank you. Uh, thank you. <laughs> and now you've known each other uh, quite a while, right? I mean, you're, you're now you're enjoying a lot of success with your singing group, Wild Orchid, but you've known each other for years, right? Yeah, since, since we were little girls. Eight or nine years old. Wow, wow. so you're almost like sisters. Uh, yeah. yeah. Years. The group's been together for seven years. Uh, Renee and I did a singing TV show together, Kids Incorporated. Stephanie's also been doing the acting and singing things since she was eight years old, so we all knew each other. Mm -hmm. oh. um, the group's been together for seven years as Wild Orchid because Stephanie and Renee coincidentally went to high school together through play production. Wow, oh, so it all worked yeah. out. And yeah. all kind of just came together. Okay, now, and now, and now you actually, uh, you can sing a cappella, I understand, and you have a song for us today that you were going to do. Yes. Uh, a little something special little for something, the show. Yeah, yes. just for Oddville. Okay, uh, oh. well, uh, do you need any kind of warm-up? Oh, no, we're, we're ready. We're ready to go. Okay. okay. Hello, 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 everybody. Just sit back and watch your app TV. Wild Orchid is here on Oddville. Relax and chill. Wow. Oh, that was great. That was you, great. Know, you know, we just made that one up. It's our first time ever doing that. Just on the spot. Yeah. yeah. And, and that you don't great. need like the little thing where you go, hmm, or the harmonica or anything. The pitch, just, no. the pitch pipe. We do need that when we do the anthem. Yeah, the anthem. The anthem, okay. You do a beautiful rendition of the anthem. I saw Aww. that. Thank, Thank you. you. You're welcome. Thanks what? a lot. All right. <laughs> now, now, are you uh, are you ladies currently uh, attached, uh, you know, with uh, guys? Attached uh, to you, babe. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now, uh, what, what, what do you, uh, uh, what do you uh, ladies look for in a, in a, uh, a fella? Uh, well, the silent type is nice. <laughs> <laughs> what does, wait, what's up with, with David? David? Now, he just never talks, he, and this is acceptable here. He, he just has a lot on his mind. Now, uh, David. Now, <laughs> now, he's never encountered the Wild Orchid Tickle yes. Monster. Uh -oh. oh, no. See, the Wild Orchid Tickle Monster usually can get a reaction from people. Oh, okay, uh, girls, come on. That might be go. interesting. David. Come on, David. <laughs> he's not going to make a face. Oh. We couldn't break See, him. See, we scared him. We couldn't oh. break him. <laughs> Oh, we scared him at least. He comes back. <laughs> so not All right, very he, uh, he friendly, some, uh, David. Some, uh, okay. some mind stuff right now. Okay, yeah, let him just right. think about it a little bit. Right, uh, okay. okay. That was probably uh, pretty scary, you know. Uh, but it's, it's different for him. Okay. Uh, uh, all right, well, uh, now please stay with us, uh, ladies. We want to bring out our next guest, if we may. Definitely. Um, okay, uh, so uh, without further ado, let's please welcome Mr. Jeremy Graham. <laughs> Well, thank you. Welcome to the show. Thanks. Uh, now, you're going to do something special for us today. Uh, I don't know if it's special, but sure. But it's a little different. It's, uh, it's a little bit off. Okay, and what is that? Uh, I'm going to place as many clothespins as I can fit on my face. Oh, oh my God. Okay. Uh, well, please. Uh, very, very cool. <laughs> so now, about how many do you have in that uh, bag there? It's a penalty bag, so it says about 40, but I don't know. Uh, it's oh a used God. bag. So. Do you like pain? I'm not a huge fan Does it of turn pain. turn you on? <laughs> the pen. Is that painful? Uh, it's uncomfortable more so than anything else. That's so cool. You like, uh, now, do you prefer oh the wood gosh, over uh, plastic? Like uh, I've, I've never tried the plastic. I, I would imagine that it would uh, flip off easier than the wood. The wood is... 
you oh know, kind of kind of grabs goodness. in there. Okay. Now, did someone uh, teach you? Was this handed down from a generation? Uh, or a friend of or? mine who's a gaffer was on set one day, and he just turned to me and he had him hanging off of his eyelids, and I thought, okay, I can <laughs> I can top that. Okay. And this is cool. You can like do this at parties, and you'll be really popular. <laughs> That's if, a if there are clothes pins at a given party, why sure, I suppose I could. You can, you can oh. do that. Uh, and he just keeps going. Oh, this is great. Oh no, the eyes. Oh. Oh, that's, that's the cool. part that looks really painful. Yeah, it must hurt around the eyes, no? Uh, no, the, eye, the eyebrows aren't bad. I had piercings there once, and there's like no nerve endings up there, so. So for oh Halloween, you could be like clothespin boy or something. <laughs> yes, yes, I could. That's cool, oh. though. Wow. <laughs> oh, no. Now, the skin is sensitive I there. Know, how do you yeah, the skin, the skin, these I'll take off first. Oh. Uh, now, you say you work in uh, uh, movies. You're actually a, a best boy, right? Yes, uh, I am. Now, I, I always see that title at, on the credits, and I never understood what that means, uh, Best Boy. What, what is that? Uh? I set up uh, lights and electricity. Uh, if we don't have a generator, I go out and find where to steal the electricity <laughs> from and steal that. There we go. Uh, it's okay. good fun. So, uh, that's so yeah! 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 Great town. Please uh, come have a seat and uh, join us here. Uh, uh, between... Now, uh, now, you ladies haven't tried uh, putting clothespins on your bodies at all. No, uh, no, no. I, I, I would never be that good at it, though. I know. It's, why, it's, why, thank you. Look, they move! Yeah. They move! That's so cool! Uh, 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 don't uh, go away. We have lots more. Uh, Melissa, maybe you could tell us what's uh, coming up. Sure. Coming up, we have a dance tribute to Dracula, and also a guy who can stand on his fingertips and whistle like a bird. Wow. So, uh, stay tuned. Lots more Oddville to come. Okay, uh, welcome back to the program. Uh, we're just getting started here. Uh, um, we now have uh, something uh, very special. Uh, it's a dance tribute to Vlad the Impaler, who was uh, the real-life inspiration for Dracula. Uh, please welcome interpretive dancer Ms. Suzanne Muldowney. <laughs> When you uh, now uh, that's Vlad the Impaler, and uh, now what were you doing uh, signifying with the uh, stake uh, there? Uh. Um, for people who may not realize it, uh, Dracula executed the wrongdoers of his time by skewering them like shish kebab on the ends of poles. If you want a real life inspiration, go out and see where you, a long line of telephone poles or street lights. Oh. Um, you know what? You look so familiar. Were you on Howard Stern? <gasps> Oh, uh, Where are you? I, I don't know if we should mention that. Uh, he, he, delete that. It, it, well, yeah, delete that. He's known as Mr. Medusa, actually. You shouldn't call him she by that name. Delete uh, that. Okay, yeah. all right. Uh, now, uh, I'm sorry. So now you uh, did the uh, Dracu uh, uh, Dracula, that right? That, uh, and I actually have some uh, Dracula teeth that maybe you'd want to use for no, your... Uh, no, no, I don't. Uh, oh, no. I, that's I, do, I do not use fangs. That there's something very important that I need to let everyone know about. Right. Now, now you, 
you've seen me do, you just saw me do Dracula through dance. Right. right. I'm making a minor, minor costume change. So I was dressed as Vlad. Yes. Uh. Now, this way, I'm the vampire. We could use you for our next video, you know? Yeah. Uh, but, uh, well, look, uh, if I'm in their next video, uh, it depends on what topic you use. Okay. I would like to make an appearance, but I'm, I have many different topics and themes. I'd have to know what topic you use. Well, like, you could do the Dracula thing. No one's ever done that. But it might that. not go with the kind of music you do. Well, mm. it'd have to be the right song. Maybe we could work it out. I might, yeah. I might use a different theme and depending on what talk, music you play. Talk. And, and Mr. Graham could come on with his uh, uh, clothespins uh, on the video. Okay. That would be uh, very right. cool. Okay. Uh, well, wait a minute, we can't have too many mixtures of subjects, you know. Right, because then it gets confusing. Yeah, to exactly. Exactly. You know? Okay. You spoil oh, you the integrity of any that. one act. Well, you don't smooth. want to spoil the in integrity. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, all right. Well, why don't we bring out our next guest, if we may. Uh, uh, we're very happy to have uh, Mr. Jason Spirit. <laughs> Little, there we go. There's a little room there, right? Uh, okay. Everybody okay? Uh, Get in the middle. All right. There, there we go. go. <laughs> uh, oh, are we scooting this oh, way? Oh, we're going to musical chairs today. Oh, oh, now, what, uh, um, what kind of birds were those, uh, Mrs. Well, Spirit, these are like were? pretty much my own improvisations, you know? Oh. You know, like, uh, like I, I, I would say the Brooklyn Funky Warbler, you know? Okay. That's so cool. Wow. That's uh, Can you uh, do bird sounds at all? I could do that, but I don't know what kind of bird that is. Can you do this one? Oh boy. Um, okay, well, uh, now stay tuned. Uh, there's lots more. Uh, we're going to have um, um, Mr. Spirit is actually going to play with his balls, and yeah. Wild Orchid is going to perform for us. So uh, stay tuned. But not on our fingers. <laughs> we'll be right back. Okay, uh, welcome back to the program. We're just getting started, and uh, we have so much more in store that we better just keep moving right along. Uh, we want to please welcome our next guest, uh, Ms. Rosabella Thornbloom. We'd like to bring out our next guest, too, so we can all be together. Um, please welcome Mr. Mark Yetter. Hey, Mark. Hey. Welcome, Mr. Yetter. Welcome to the program. Uh, now, you're currently uh, a student, right? Yep. And, and you're studying uh, what now? Uh, the fine arts. I'm a painter. Oh, a painter. Oh, wow. Okay. Yep. Um, and you're going to share a special uh, skill with us today. Not painting, but... Yeah, I am. Um, I take this leg behind my head, and I hop around on the opposite leg. No. Oh, wow. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's wow. see that. 
Wow, well, please have a seat yeah. here. Uh, that's, that's really wow. something. Uh, <laughs> now, now, uh, now, have you ladies tried that at all? Uh, oh, no. You know, I was, uh, that. Well, yeah, actually, I used to do something like that, but I couldn't do that here today because um, <laughs> of the nature of the outfit that, that I'm wearing. But I used to yeah. put both legs behind my head and then walk, wow. but I can't demonstrate that here. Oh. I want to know, can you do both legs? Can you alternate? I don't know. I haven't really... I haven't done it in like a year, so that's I used to cool. do it when I was little. Get the stretch, because I don't know. And no, usually guys aren't that limber. No, they're not. That's right. very impressive. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Maldowney, uh, you have a, a question? Uh, yeah. We do. No, when, when, the, when you were asking the other people, had any of them attempted a movement similar to his, uh, you didn't get as far down as me. I was gesturing, yes, I, oh. uh, I, I make a move similar to that. I did it the last time oh, I was yeah. here. Also, the move that he did, uh, it would be something right in league with some daredevil figure skaters oh, spinning wow. around that, I saw it. It's really impressive. You should have her do it. That's a good point. Oh, would you like to do that for us, Ms. Muldowney? Well, uh, you think it would be appropriate in, in the costume? Well, just maybe quickly, if you, if you have a, a, a moment. Uh. Yeah. Yes. Now, uh, I would not. I would not do that in the course of any of my normal Dracula performances. No, of course though. not. I right. Uh, right. Be well, yeah. Yeah. we'll make believe you weren't in the in the outfit when we watched that. Uh, yeah, I guess. Other dance moves or, uh, or themes that would be appropriate, but okay. not for Dracula. Okay, there we go. Um, well, uh, now a, a very special treat for everybody uh, because uh, Wild Orchid, uh, you ladies have been so great on the show uh, so far, and but. But the best is yet to come because now you're actually going to perform Yay. a song from your new yes. from your CD, yes. right? Su but Supernatural. And it's a new single yes. that yes. you're doing. It's, it's our new single. Supernatural. Supernatural. Mm -hmm. Okay. And mind you, this is the first time we're actually going to perform it only with one instrument. It's going to be with the um, acoustic electric guitar over there, and that's the only instrument we're using, and it's the so, first time. Oh, oh, oh. So this is a, a very special event. Please, uh, ladies, uh, we, we have uh, everything set up over there, and uh, All right, guys. Here we go, go. to it. Keep on, keep on giving me, keep on, keep on giving me, keep on giving me supernatural love. Love like a river. Flowing deeper than time I smell over my senses Like sweet cherry wine Stole my emotion Like a thief in the night Heard me be an offer I couldn't deny You mess me up until I can't see the ground Wanna tell the whole world About this love that I found Supernatural Keep on giving me a heaven sent from above Oh yeah, yes, supernatural love oh, I'd like to thank you for changing my world You made a woman from a little girl And my soul was searching, searching to find Something to cherish, I love so divine I'm in the time of feelings I've never felt No, it's like your magic put me under a spell Supernatural love Give me Supernatural high Hey, heaven sent from above Ooh, a supernatural love Keep on, keep 
on give me keep on giving me supernatural love supernatural love oh yes supernatural high my supernatural heaven sent from above